Hello, my name is Rhonda Kitchens. I'm a librarian at the Wilm C. Bonatti Library. I am excited to continue some of the talks we've had about LinkedIn, and I'm going to specifically focus on jobs. When we're here at our main dashboard, when you get up here and you see the briefcase, that's the job section. I'm showing my actual account. I hope you don't mind. You might find out more than you need to know. But I'm going to show you how to look for jobs, which isn't any different than some other platforms. I do have a premium, a premium account, so some things may look different, but I think specifically it's the analytics of the job. Um, I'm giving these presentations in the Moses Lake area, so that's where I'm going to go. And this is going to list the jobs out. Sometimes people think that um, LinkedIn is all white collar, but that's not true. It's a mix of all of us who are working everywhere across America and in fact the world. So don't ever let that hold you back from fully enjoying what LinkedIn has to offer. It's going to have a section where you can do sort by. You're going to have 25 miles, 100 miles or 70 miles. Should you wish to look at those? Date posted. This is pretty important. When I'm in the middle of the heat, of my uh, job hunting, I'm probably going to use these. When I'm just starting, I'll just look at the past month. Anytime is not useful unless you're simply looking for a job titles and trying to harvest keywords or finding other ways to use it. LinkedIn features, probably not useful for you, but one of the interesting things about the Fair Chance Employer, these are people that are able and willing to give people a second chance who have may have experienced incarceration or other issues. Under 10 applicants will, of course, make you feel like you might be able to come to the top. Company will give the different companies that have the job and the quantity they are offering them. And experience level lets you see the different ways you may be able to approach that particular company, including internships all the way up to the C-suites. So you also have an opportunity here to add more filters, including um, more a uh, micro approaches to the date posted uh, salary linked in features which again may not be important I believe it listed those up front and it does have industries and sometimes it gives different uh, states and areas job functions and other it gives like one more bit of distance than the other and additionally you can also apply for remote jobs if you want to make sure that is good and you can just turn it into the United States. So I'm going to go on from there back to the job search. I'm going to go to Moses Lake specifically and um, I call this gentle stalking. Um, this is networking and you're going to do it kindly, responsibly and um, make sure that you make everybody in the process comfortable. Suppose you've decided that you want to work for Mitsubishi. Here, you can go and follow what the company is doing. You'll see the leadership team and about us. You can also look at some of the things they're posted. But guess what you can also do? You can see all the employees that are uh, affiliated with the company. And also, you could do that here at People. Let's see if we can um, make this smaller. I'm not sure we can. So this is an experience. You might be, this may be used more likely for looking for names. And, uh, in fact, it may be useful. These are the people that you can connect with. If you see here, they have their connections open. And this is what you do. Sometimes the people without the images may have suppressed them or they may not be particularly active. You're going to go here and add a note to see this is going to encourage them to accept your connection, let them know you're thinking about working for the company, you're interested in the company, you're interested in them and the things that they may post and share. Be be um, be um very respectful and of course business-like because that's what LinkedIn is. And if you know they've done something fabulous, I would put this in the note. I really love how you, the speech that you gave or the thing that you did in the community. And this will increase your opportunities to be connected with them because this is a really great place to be. Um, it's talking about life with a company, um, about people, insights, and ads which you may not need to see. And you're going to be able to lightly stalk and get business intelligence information. <clears throat> Sorry about my cough. And additionally, you may be able to 
um, go ahead and form connections and network with people you may not have access to. This is especially helpful perhaps if you're applying from across the country. Another really key part of this job hunting piece, I want to take you up here to remind you of the section called settings and privacy. This is another part of job hunting on LinkedIn. Come over here and you'll see uh, these are very important. If you haven't upgraded these recently, please take the time to go over it. But there's a section called job seeking preferences. Go through this each individually, see what means something to do. If you're looking for opportunities, let recruit recruiters know. Signal interest, uh, share your profile when um, you click apply. My thing is yes, C commute preferences, and all sorts of other things. As part of your job hunting process, also make each time you're up and hunting for a job, make sure you go through this section and fill it out. Anyway, I hope this was helpful and I'm glad you're looking at our LinkedIn series. Thank you.